Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I wanted to hop on here because my daughter and I uh, were on our way to Pretend City, but she fell asleep. So I've been wanting to go ahead and film a what's in my baby bag video for the longest time. I've been so busy with Naomi. I feel like she has um, just this beautiful, crazy, wild personality that I love. And so I'm constantly changing, chasing her around everywhere. And so now that she's sleeping, I figure, hey, I need to hop on here. I need to make the videos that I just like, feel like I really want to share. Um, Naomi's now a toddler, so everything's changed, but I still want to kind of just film what I can. Um, but I hope you enjoy. All right, so I'm gonna do this as best as I can. Uh, so first off, I wanna just talk about my baby bag. Um, my baby bag is from Mina Bay. I think this brand is so amazing because a lot of their stuff is just super luxurious. It looks very unique, uh, trendy, and I just love it because it looks like something I could use for work later down the road, um, but it's just so much um, space. Uh, which I love, um, which you'll be able to go ahead and see in a second. Um, I don't really carry much in here um, besides my keys. Um, I don't have them in there now. Naomi kind of spilled something in there, so I'm not going to show you that part there. Um, but what I love is that it has like these really, um, you know, uh, big pockets in here. This will actually like allow you to put stuff in here currently. I'm going to be very transparent, but I have just these like binkies that um, Naomi just kind of dropped on the floor. Um, but I'll show you in a second that I have these wipies that I typically use um, last case resort if I need to kind of wipe them down. So those are there. I have this cute little ball. This is from Mushy and I love it because... Um, I keep her binkies in here and um, Naomi is now capable of just kind of reaching in there and kind of grabbing it on her own, which is something I love because it kind of gives her like that, you know, um, power to kind of make decisions on her own. So if she needs something, she'll go ahead and grab it herself. Back here, um, I have her tablet. This um, was something that um, I was able to get for her. It's it's great to have something like this uh, for on the road. I don't let Naomi have too much screen time, but I do just take it with me in case, you know, there's just those times where she is like starts crying and, and doesn't really have the patience. Um, this really does come in handy. And sometimes I'll have like a little popper or some type of fidget toy for her to use in case you know, she's a little bit more. What I really love about this bag is that you can actually tuck in these straps in here. It also has a magnet here, which allows you to just kind of keep everything tugged and just really tight in there. Um, there's a zipper here. I love this because this is where I keep my wallet. So I, I love this because it's just the perfect um, way to just kind of make sure it's secure especially like with the fact that it's like behind or it's like on my back so I know like that I'll feel it um, if somebody tries to grab <laughs> my wallet um, but I just love it because it's just perfect and I'll, I'll mostly keep my items here so if I need like a chapstick or, or just something like a lipstick um, I'll kind of just toss it there um, I mostly keep my keys on one side of the pockets um, and then today, I just happened to have um, one of my lipsticks here. Um, so this is the day after Thanksgiving. Um, I had that there just so for emergencies. Um, another thing is that I haven't done so, but I mean, you can tell it's kind of like a little worn down here. Um, but it's super easy to clean. You can get like a nice wipey and just like kind of wipe it down. Super just so easy to clean. Um, and then here we go. I have this zipper here. What's really cool is that it just kind of tucks in. So it's not just kind of loose, but I, I really do love that feature because it just keeps everything secure. Things don't fall out. Um, so that's really neat. And so here we're gonna unzip it. Um, this is what I have. So this is what I have right now. All right, so I just want to warn you guys, I live in a crazy household, so I am sorry if it gets a little loud and you hear a little bit of background noise. 
Um, but so first off, I'm going to start off with this blanket. Um, this blanket is like the cutest thing I've ever seen. Um, this one is from Mushy. Um, it's a cute mustard yellow um, blanket. It's super cute. Um, so I have that. Um, and then next, you can see that I have a change of clothes here. Um, this is just like a two-piece set. Um, this I did get, I believe, at Target. Super cute. Matches my outfit. <laughs> um, we got to do that, obviously. Um, but yeah, super cute. Um, this is just a change of clothes. You want to make sure you have a change of clothes because, you know, in case there's like a blowout or, you know, it starts getting cold later on in the day or whatever it might be, it's always good to have like a change of clothes uh, for your child. Um, but yes, so as you can see here, it opens up pretty wide there from the sides. You can just see that there's so much space, so many pockets, which I love, and I'll kind of get into each and every one of them next. Um, so first off back here, we have a little compartment. This is where I keep my daughter's uh, changing bag. Um, so what's really neat about Mina Bay is that they have so many just things that are so beneficial for you. So I'm going to try to open this with one hand, um, but let's see here. So you take this out. Here's another bag. This is um, a bag that has like a, the actual changing pad in it. Um, so I won't fully take it out, but um, here it is. Um, or actually, I'll just take it out so you can see it. All right, next I have the changing pad. So we're gonna fully open this so you can see how big it is. I love this because of how wide it is. Um, it's really important for me to make sure that my daughter does not touch anything on like a baby changing station. She likes to just grab things when she's um, getting changed. And so I love this because it's comfortable. It's not like a harsh material. Um, and then it's easy to wash. So you can just, you know, go ahead and uh, clean it really easily. Um, then you can just kind of, you know, put it back into the bag, tuck it in into your backpack. Um, this you can also use out as a wet bag, which is really cool. You know, like I mentioned before, if you have a blowout, you can just quickly, you know, wash the clothes with some soap um, if you're out and about and then kind of tuck it in here um, and then zip it up. So it's really neat. Um, you don't have, you know, to put, you know, your daughter, or your sons or, you know, your babies um, clothes back into this bag. I want to make sure to keep this as sanitary as possible. Um, so next we have the, um, diapers on this side. Um, I only have a few cause I was only going to go out for like an hour or two. Um, I currently, um, do have, um, formula for my daughter. I got this at mother's market. Um, A2 milk is what I've been giving her. Um, she really likes this a lot. <clears throat> she had colic since she was a baby and, and she still kind of struggles with gut issues. Um, so this has been really nice um, just because she's she, she really likes it. And as you can see, it says 12 to 36 months. She's currently 17 months. Um, so I, I still use it. Um, she leans more towards food and real milk, but this is just good to have, you know, whenever your baby's fussy, you know, wants to get comforted by a bottle, this is just good to have on hand. Uh, next, we have these Como Tomo bottles. Um, this bottle is just a bottle that Naomi has loved since day one. I think what she really loves about this bottle is the fact that it has a really wide nipple um it kind of resembles just you know a nipple so um yeah these bottles are really nice um one thing that i i don't like sometimes is that when you put it um you know on a table it can kind of fall um but you know even when it does fall honestly these are such great bottles i love them um naomi loves them and that's like the most important thing for me um and then um there's just a whole bunch of pockets here um so typically i like to get her some snacks um these aren't just the snacks that i normally give her these just happen to be some snacks that my mom got my my daughter um 
she just likes to buy her so many little things, little snacks here and there. So I just tuck these in here. Um, and then I have a teething toy since her uh, molars are coming in. This one's from Mushy. Super cute. Uh, she's been watching Elmo recently, so she knows what a rocket ship is. So I thought that was really neat. Um, so I'll just kind of tuck it in there. But you can also just like add your wallet in here as well. Such a cute, safe place since it has a zipper. Um, so just put that there. And then as you can see, um, I'm just going to take these out so you can kind of get like a better glimpse of what's in here. So there's like a whole bunch of space. There you go. Sorry if I'm moving it too much. Um, here I like to keep um, just, you know, um, some sunscreen and some hand sanitizer. And then on this end, I have these like diaper bags um, so that whenever she has a, like a dirty diaper and I'm not like accessible to like some type of trash can, I'm changing her in the car. I can just toss them in here and these smell really good so you can't really smell, um, you know, the actual poop or pee. <laughs> And then in here, I just carry oatmeal. Um, I swear I have cuter bags, but you know, when you're a mom, sometimes you, you just don't go for the aesthetic. You just kind of, <laughs> you know, do as best as you can to pack, you know, a diaper bag while your daughter or son or your baby is just wanting you so badly. So Pack some oatmeal in here. Um, I can easily ask for like a cup or a spoon um, from just any single like place, like a restaurant or anything like that. And then I can just mix it up. It kind of frees up some space there. So you don't have to just add a plate or a bowl um, and a spoon there. And my daughter's not really that picky either. So I'm just kind of go with that. Um, back here, there's not really much here, but it's really cool to just kind of put, again, you know, maybe like um, some toiletries, maybe um, just like some toys um, or just anything really that you like. I, I don't really have anything there today. Um, and then back here, I have the infamous buggy wipes. These are so good. Um, it's really cool to just pull them out. Naomi is so cute lately she's been kind of you know using napkins to like wipe her nose which is really cute so these she really likes they're softer and don't really irritate her skin um so there's that i'll just leave that out because i can't put it back in and then these are the um the wipes for um the binkies so i just kind of I try not to use them, but I mean, you know, kids are just throwing things left and right. So these kind of come in handy um, whenever I'm on, I'm at my last binky and I desperately need one for her because she's crying off the top of her lungs. So this one's just perfect because it just, it, it does the job, right? Um, but that's pretty much all I have in here. Um, I try to keep it simple. I try to make sure I don't, you know, over... You know, so here's the bag. I wanted you guys to just kind of see it, but um, I really love it. I'll go ahead and link their stuff below along with any other products that I used um, on here. But So that concludes my video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you like it, please like and, you know, subscribe. That would be awesome. Um, but I hope you guys have an amazing day and continue to just ch like check in and tune in and uh, see any other videos that I might have. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye!